Is on tonight for two men who shot and killed a security guard during an attempted robbery of an underground gambling operation near the Hollywood Hills. The shooting happened around 3:30 at a nightclub where an illegal poker game was underway. The security guard was shot and killed after confronting the masked gunman. KTLA's Rick Chambers is live in the Cahuenga Pass with the latest on the investigation tonight. Rick. Yeah, share that building across the street houses a number of different businesses. You've got the roof hookah lounge up on top, and you've got what's called the Moff Club on the first floor. We believe that's where the gambling was taking place. And there's a speakeasy type of entrance at the rear of the building. You have to knock on a reinforced door, then look up at a camera to be identified, which means that the gunman may have had familiar faces. Security cameras capture stunned patrons fleeing an illegal gambling club over near Universal following a shooting and a botched robbery. Two suspects entered, uh, both armed, wearing ski masks. They came in through a rear entrance right about 3.35 this morning. Immediately confronted their victim who was operating in a, uh, it's like a security guard. One of the suspects is, uh, basically shoots him right as he walks in the door. That security guard has now been identified as Anthony Rivas, said to be in his early 30s. The robbers left empty handed out that same back door shortly after shooting him, while gamblers piled out the front of the building. There's multiple things here. There's two stories, may have been the hookah lounge on the top story and some sort of gambling operation on the bottom. That kind of activity doesn't belong here because there's always a lot of trouble that follows that kind of activity. This nearby businesswoman who wants to remain anonymous claims that she walked into that club recently just to take a look. And I saw they were gambling and they have all these, you know, young girls that come along dressed up kind of like the ones that hang out in Las Vegas and they surround the men that are gambling and that's what's going on there. Police responded shortly after the 911 call started coming in. Two men were seen being escorted out in handcuffs, part of a crowd of nearly 30 that were apparently taking part in the cash poker game. Others were questioned as they sat on the curb. Tonight, detectives with the LAPD and Homeland Security were back here at the club taking a much closer look at this extensive casino-like setup, but didn't want to speak on camera. And police are telling us tonight that those suspects used rifles during this holdup and that security guard was shot multiple times. In the Coenga Pass, I'm Rick Chambers. Guys, let me throw it back to you in the studio. Rick, thank you.